Quick search on Google for Symphony of the Night Easy. One thing that has always bothered me is just how easy it is. I've played this game all the way through dozens of times. Ugh, easy. Pathetically easy. There is practically no difficulty. I mean, it's... That's untrue. I think that's unfair. The game has difficulty. Yeah, it's called luck mode. No, no, no. So the game has difficulty. It's just very, very early on that you have it. Abyssinian Curved Sword. Let's equip it for a second. See if it has anything weird that it does. That's kind of cool. That is pretty cool, actually. I like the way it looks. We'll use it for a while. And I, think, I think generally the, the consensus seems to be if it looks kind of magic, then it probably has a special magic attack. That makes a lot of sense. If it doesn't, then yeah. I haven't actually got hit by the skulls yet. <laughs> yeah, you're getting hit by virtually nothing. And yeah, you can't kill those guys. I'm gonna keep on trying. They think, spite me with their existence. I team. think they've got like 999 HP. Oh really? Yeah, it's not gonna work. And you can't do a single bit of damage to them. Wow, okay. At some point I dropped my axe, by the way. Oh no. Oh, when that happened. Ooh, it's recolored. Yeah. Slightly green. Does it have does it have a floating eyeball though, I wonder? What the hell? What did I just do? Did you do a I did a special attack with this. I just don't know what it was. Was it no. Honda? No, it's not an Honda. It doesn't look like it anyway. Oh. Yeah. Sure you can. I mean it. It's kind of cool. Look, it's a scythe. It's a scythe boomerang. Should have started on luck, mate. <laughs> no, we shouldn't, because I would have died so many times so early on. Yeah, that's... and it would have been so boring for everybody to watch. I don't know, I think there's a certain amount of pleasure to be derived from watching somebody masochistically fail again and again and again. Yeah, but that's why we haven't I want to be the guy let's play at some point. Oh, no, we're no. never doing that. Oh, thank we God. are never, ever doing LP if I want to be the guy, okay? Life is too short for that. Like, I... Other people have beaten I want to be the guy so that we don't have to. I have beaten three bosses and I want to be the guy. One of them was Dracula. It took me ages. And I'm not bad at platforming games, right? By any means. So I'm quite good at them, I think. No, I think there just comes a point where you realise your success in those kinds of games is almost purely based on muscle memory. Yeah, At is. which point, you know, what's the point? They kind of lose their charm. Yeah. It was interesting, actually. So I played Celeste very recently. Yeah. Which is very much a game of that ilk. Muscle memory. Yeah. Oh, you know, I was thinking about getting it now. Um, it's a lot like uh, Meat Boy. Ugh. Except less punishing. Actually, I'm not sure. But basically what happens is by the end of the game... Ooh, the yeah. I'm, re I'm, I'm, I'm rolling my eyes here so hard. Um, no. Things tried to kill me. That was interesting. I, I dodged them completely by accident. It was great. You're an autopilot now. Um, he has become Jedi. <laughs> so, uh, what I noticed with... Uh, hold on. Is this... So no, we're, this is, we're going up, so that's fine. Yes. We're not going down yet. Um, yeah, so, you get to the end of the game, and, you know, it's fairly challenging. But they basically imply that the end of the game isn't really the end. The end of the game is actually the post-game. You know? Right, so they, what, they try and do like a reverse well, Mario, yeah. Mario Odyssey then? Kinda, yeah, I think. Ow. Oh, damn it. These are the most lethal things in the goddamn castle. Oh. meal ticket. What the hell do these things do? I think they just generate a random food item. 
All right, well, we're going to get all of them and see what happens. There aren't any of them. No. Library cards. It's down. Scroll down. Da, 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 da. Pizza meal ticket. Mystery food ticket. Here we are. Okay, what have we got? Me. We have got curry rice. Nice. Yeah, good work. Pineapple. Um, okay, and cheese. Cheese. Oh, delicious cheese. Mm, I, I'm a big fan of cheese. I've got an amazing I Love White uh, blue cheese in my fridge right now. What, a, uh, what, proper Stilton or? Um, I do not know. I was very drunk when I bought it. You were out really, really late and you were like, okay, guys, gotta wait. I've just got to nip into a shop and I've got to buy some cheese. That's literally what happened. Actually, game, I quite like a save point. Ow! Alright. Fine game. Uh-oh. That's bringing out the big guns. Oh, uh, where are my potions? Should I just use my food? Let's use my dim sum. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. That did not heal for as much as I thought it would. You uh, expect, you're you spending food in this game just because it's not potions to in, to heal, like, insane amounts. Well, I re remember the turkey roast healing for more than a potion. Yeah, but that's because it's a turkey roast. Okay. As any, as any fool know, Castlevania, in, Car in, in Castlevania, turkey roasts are, like, the... the bomb. Uh, where is it? Oh no! Got him. That was close. There we go, level up. Pretty good at judging. Again, I'm like not bad at platformers. I bet you're wondering what happens if you get hit by one of those lasers. Yeah, you probably die. You could find out? No! Miles <laughs> away from a save point. Uh, after having gone through this living hell of a set of rooms. See, this is actually quite difficult because if you just get bounced by one of those things. You're gonna eat so much damage. Ooh, hello. Oh, Jesus Christ! hey -oh. Okay. And so we come to the toughest enemy in the game. <laughs> uh, Alright. Hmm. Okay, just think about what you can do. Here. He who runs... He who flees... He runs away. No, you know what I can do? He can't attack up a hill. And I have spells. So if I, think, I... I think Nat is going to very, very quickly realise the fatal flaw in this plan, but uh, yes. we're going to just... Uh, we're just gonna oh, let God, him, hold on. We're just going to let him work out that issue. I just used all my stuff. That's okay. We don't care about using items here. See? Your puny bat friend does nothing. Ah! He guards against everything because he is the Guardian! Okay, well, hello. I got past him. Oh, there's another one. Except it's his friend! Friends everywhere! Oh, there we go, that's fine. Remember, if in doubt, damage boost. No. Hmm. He's not taking very much damage, and he's going to repeat this fire attack. Oh. Hello. I managed to hit him. Got hit. Wait. Come on. Oh, fuck off. Oh. 
on that. Oh no! <laughs> oh, the lethal! Oh, how far ago it was a save point? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> hmm. So, uh, yeah, about, <laughs> so, yeah, about that. How far ago was your last save point? Well, I have a horrible feeling. It's probably in the library somewhere, I think. Yeah. Oh, before the boss I destroyed. Why is that boss so easy and they're so hard? Ugh. I won't question it. I was due a beating and I got it. It was nice to see you get taken down a peg. <laughs> or two. Oh no, I was on the outer wall somewhere apparently. That's not that bad then actually. I'm quite close to being able to fight them again. Uh, no, it's because you... I. Yeah, oh. I told you, I've explored the entire library. Oh, of course, oh, of course, it was just before, yeah. Just for this guy. Who wasn't in the library, he was here. Hello, Frankenstein, how are you? I feel like this boss would be a lot tougher, you know, were he to deal damage to you simply by you walking into his massive fuck off sized hammer. Yeah, but that would be really silly because the hammer isn't actually attacking you. Since when is that stop video game logic? Well, it should. He is I'm... part of the enemy sprite, therefore he does damage to you. No, I am glad Castlevania doesn't uh, apply that because that's a silly idea. Anyway. I'm going to go back into that corridor. I'm going to murder all the things that murdered me last time. And they're going to like it. You want to grab a... You, you, you want to grab an iced tea, folks? This could be a while. They... S I let them spite me by doing this. They knew what they were signing up for. Like, they provoked me. Therefore, they must all die. That's how it works. It does mean I have to go through Spike Hall Corridor again, but now I know how to deal with it. You don't even have to go that way, you could go down. Yeah, but I could go through Spike Hall Corridor. Yes, or you could go down! Oh wow, okay. So yeah, that's what happens. They hit quite hard, don't they? And yes, this is why having the axe at this point in the game is actually pretty good. Yes, because the axe is amazing. But it makes it boring! You're like, it makes it boring just after I died. Two yeah. ridiculous stuff going on. I need to see you die. I crave the blood. Monster vile. Monster. 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 Monster vile. Is it a vile monster or a vile of monsters? To vile of our monsters. Ah. Oh. Very smart. Okay, do you call it Monster Munch or Monster Munch? Monster Munch. Monster Munch. Hey, that's what it is. It's Monster Munch. It doesn't say Monster Munch. It's Monster not from Monster. Munch. I'm literally going here just so I have that room explored. <laughs> Otherwise it will annoy me. Because I am a true Castlevania player. Castlevania for life. Uh, no, we're not going to get to that first. Ooh. No. This time we'll have the axe for those guys. I wish there was a way to see what enemy HP was like, actually. It would be very helpful. There we go, the dim sun is set. And then we're going to go back and save. You did miss that one up above, though. Oh, really? I thought that was the entrance to the... Area of death. No. Oh, okay. Remember, Mr. Boss. I wonder if Nat realizes he didn't actually explore this bit. Oh, really? Like in the <laughs> in the in the Santa Castle. No, I had no idea that I. Had by the way, idea. by the way, by the way. What? Oh, actually, that's no, all right. Where is it? Well, I had no idea, so there you go. The more you know. And knowing is half the battle. Exactly. Right. But 9% of the work takes 10% of the effort. 
Okay, so I can get through that corridor just by damage boosting through. That's not what I want to do. I want to kill those things. Is so what you're going to do is you're going to go save? Yes. Ah, uh, sensible. So you're probably wondering what the point of these guys is because they're so pathetically easy to kill, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I am actually wondering. Well, keep wondering. What is this? You want me to tell you everything? I, I mean, is there a reason their skulls show up? I, I, I thought they would resurrect or something because mm. they're so easy to kill. It's a mystery. Nobody knows. You clearly have an idea of what they do. Why, well, 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 of course I have an idea. Of course I know exactly what it is that they do. Guys, if, if he's just lying... And why it's so cool to kill them... They like children or something. So... This isn't like some sort of like dark near-esque thing or something. I don't know. You're, you're hinting at something weird going on. No, I'm just saying like, you know... Like, I don't know. What's there in are here. three of them in a room. Who knows? Who knows what you might get for killing them? Over again. I'm just utterly confused at this point. I'm done. Let's kill them one more time and see what happens. Maybe it would help if your luck was boosted to abnormally high levels. Alright, well, let's see. No, 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 no. I mean to abnormally high levels. Well, where the hell? Summon Scars and Ally. No, not what we want, not what we want, not what we want. Where the hell is my luck potion? And then, with my higher luck, let's beat them up. No. Are you meant to farm these things? Is that what they... It gave me money. D, it gave me money. Yeah, 25 whole dollars. You know what you can buy with 25 whole dollars? A subscription to Nintendo Power. Yes! If you just literally maybe farm this corridor for no reason. I'll see you in five weeks. My work here is done. No, this is unaccept. Why did that one disappear? Ooh, it's a mystery! Alright, I'm done with this. I'm done with you provoking me into running up and down this corridor. We're going to go and fight the dudes that I wanted to fight to begin with. For, you know, deigning to exist and being able to kill me. It's a real pity he didn't find out about the thing. The thing in the corridor. I'm not going to find out about the thing in the corridor. The thing with those guys. Nope. Nope. I can tell he's tempted. Alright, I don't have to fight you. They're just corpse weeds. They're nothing to be afraid of. They are hilarious enemies. Mainly because they don't really do anything. Look so, at this. So, 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 the, so, the, so the later Castlevania games basically say that they grow from oons, which are like small ones, like which, which we've encountered earlier on in the game, which don't grow up into like more plants, oh, okay. and they and they feed off corpses. Oh, and okay. they take on the face of the corpse that they grew out of. Huh. But Very at the same time, an Oon which drinks loads and loads, which is, how do they put it in Port Over Oon? Fattened copiously on vast amounts of human blood grow into our runes, which are those, like, you know, naked ladies and plants. Oh, okay, cool. I mean, I'm not, I mean, I'm not entirely sure what mythology they come from, but... Uh...